All right, so I just uh, purchased this bandtop bandsaw from uh, Harbor Freight. We'll see how good it is. I'm going to do an unboxing, but I'm going to do an unboxing in high speed only because there's plenty of videos that are unboxing this thing. So, yeah, it's a nine inch uh, bench top. Just what I need. I paid $119. It was on sale right now at Harbor Freight. So, yeah, the next video will be the unboxing in high speed. So, Keep your eyes open. Yes, I am wearing a back brace because my back hurts. So here we go. All right, I think I've done the setup. Um, I don't know if you know this is a belt here seems to be running true and centered like it should uh, the only thing I had to do is adjust these here the guides both the top and bottom okay you don't want them touching really don't want them rubbing but just close enough as close as you can without rubbing basically um, it's ready to go I just gotta put the table on this will adjust up and down pretty nice uh, yeah I'm gonna put the table on and take our first spin I've tightened this up over here this uh, blade was off so I put it on and then uh, adjusted the uh, what you may call it the pressure I guess you could call it on this wheel and yeah it's running true I don't have to adjust this this is this is oops this is in case it's not in the center of the uh, the wheel and this is for the amount of tension you want on the on the blade and this here is for taking the blade on and off so yeah let's put the uh, the table on and see how it looks okay my only complaint right now is there's oil all over the place um, I guess it's better to have it oiled than not oiled but I don't know customers shouldn't have to wipe it all down this here is the guide lock basically it uh, locks your guide once you have it adjusted to your height and then I had to adjust let's see if I can see this this screw right here oops okay I had to move it up a little bit so it would be square with the machine this is as square as I'm gonna get it I think um, yeah for now anyway um, and then once you have it set you can put this on zero but um, yeah it's hard to tell right now if it's square or not but it's as square as I'm gonna attempt it right now if you look at it this way see it's pretty square I think I don't think it has to go more or not maybe we'll see once I cut so yeah there you have it um, I had to take this screw thing out right here I had to take this off totally by unscrewing screwing the, the, the screw basically take the whole thing out to get this in in place these are just guides okay and I couldn't get it to bend over or you know what I mean I had to fight it so I just so screw it I'll just take this off totally put in the table put this back in and now everything's in place like it should be this is nice and tight um, I gotta do is plug it in this is I guess to remove the bottom wheel I don't see a need for that unless it really gets bad and dirty I guess this is for your vacuum if you want to suck up which I do have a, a vacuum I can fit on this um, yeah but I'm gonna be doing little things uh, 
again, let's see what's, uh, what else is on here that I can show you. Yeah, this is for up and down, of course, but then you got to lock it, okay? This is for your tilting, and I've showed you everything else. All right, let's plug it in and see what happens. All right, let's plug the puppy in and see what happens. There we go. All right, do we dare turn this on? Here we go. vibration there. I guess I just need to uh, maybe I'll put it on my bench over there. This on my desk right now. So yeah. Alright. Well I'm ready to play with this now. So far I like it. Um, it is what it is. It's just one speed but yeah. If you ask my opinion, would I buy it again? Yeah, probably. These are kind of cheap. I wish they would have made them out of metal or something. It's just plastic. I mean, how long is this going to last, right? The cover is plastic. The rest is metal. But same thing with the bottom. So, yeah. All right. Here's the mortar. One third horsepower. And it is what it is. Hey, if you like this video and that helped you a little bit on deciding on whether or not to buy this thing, I'd say yeah. I mean, you're not spending a whole lot of money. So, you just need a little band saw like this one. Yeah. If you're easy on it and you don't abuse it, it should last. And if these do ever break, I'll put a metal one on there. Easy. Oh, it's even got a little side glass. How about that? Well, that's so you can adjust. Huh, that's pretty good. I like that. Hmm. It looks like it's in the center, too. See that? I don't know if you can see it, but it's in the center of the wheel. All right. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe. And... Don't forget to hit the bell for anything else I might be buying. I love toys. Thanks for watching.